This is a quick video of how I'm going to repurpose a car seat sensor. So this is a car seat sensor and you'll find it in uh, car seats and uh, it's just a pressure sensor that uh, tells the computer in the car that somebody's sitting in that seat. So what they are is just some uh, you know polyethylene uh, on top here and then this, this piece of polyethylene has a uh, uh, carbon on it just printed on there and then this one here has a uh, this is a spacer here with holes in it and then another sheet of polyethylene with uh, carbon uh, ink on it and uh, and then a sheet on the bottom and these are all sandwiched together and when you apply pressure to one of these it pushes through this uh, little spacer here makes contact with this piece of carbon down here and it, it closes your circuit and so um, it tells the car that somebody's sitting in that seat so what i'm going to do is i'm going to use this for an early warning system uh, for my workshop here so when somebody walks up and steps on a on a mat coming into the close to the front door alarm's going to go off and i'll know that somebody's uh, outside so what i'm doing is i just used a uh, this is just a remote remote doorbell i took it apart and uh, what i'm going to do it's a it's a wooden step out there i'm just going to run this wire underneath leave that underneath there and then this uh this here is going to be uh, actually the bottom side of this uh, is it's got the glue on the bottom it sticks down and I'm going to put it underneath a, uh, a car mat here I'll put it under the floor mat coming in there it goes already and this is the uh, the doorbell I'll put that up there and then when somebody comes in steps on it the alarm goes off and uh, get, give me an early warning so uh, that, that's all there is to it. Very simple little uh, little device. Uh, didn't really have to make anything. And uh, yeah, just a car seat sensor underneath the floor mat. And uh, it'll give me a little early warning when somebody walks up to the, uh, to the shop here. So uh, thank you.